Uh, welcome back to Dyer Gold Prospecting. We're going to do a last little push, a little last hoorah on the deer for the season. But we're going to make our way back to where we've been hunting via what I always call Quartz Creek. And we still got about four and a half hours till dark, so I'm going to stop and do a few pans while we're back here. So this is going to be a little bit of a hunting slash prospecting video. But uh, uh, his belt with his knife kept falling, so he's taking it off. But plenty of deer tracks in the snow, and we're still down by the main creek. But we get back in here, get us a couple pans of material. We'll be back. We're up here, what I call Quartz Creek. And uh, it has changed a lot since last spring when I was up in here. Still got this great big inside bend here. But the creek, the flow, was over on this side. Well, now it's all shifted over, washed all the material out. This was all a gravel bar. So that's what's left of it. It's exposed a lot of big cobble, a lot of big boulders. But... At least we still got. Thing has we still got a lot of big cobble piled up over here now, which wasn't there last year. So, but it's exposed a lot of. Some clay. A lot of the clay. Shell. I might have to try to get this material out of this little pocket. It's about like a little boil hole and. Bedrock. There's some uh, nice little cobble in there. <coughs> but I've done about four pans. I haven't really went down very far, but I got my underneath a pretty good piece of cobble. Broke my shovel handle. I ain't found no color. It might have washed all my gold out of this spot, or it's so cool. it might have relocated. One thing hasn't changed. But, yeah, as Dakota keeps trying to say, there's plenty of quartz in here. This is just five minutes worth him walking around. And underneath his gloves, big piece of quartz. I didn't want them in the snow. But, yeah, there's, there's plenty of good looking material up here that we might just have to go find the gold. My little hot spot washed out. But I might come back on if I find anything. I'll probably do a few more pans. And we're going to head up and sit this evening. So we'll catch you in a bit. Alright. Cleaned out that little spot there in the clay. I see some garnets. I see a big old lead shot. I see two, I don't even know if this will bring it up. Just left of that lead shot, there's a little micro speck up there. And there's another one there. In the middle of the screen. Let's see if we can see it. So there's still some in here. But we'll have to find another concentration like we did last year. Well, just for kicks. Uh, took a couple big chunks of clay out of that which seems to be pretty solid clay. Not a lot of grit in it. Now I went ahead and put it in here and panned it out. As you can see, I still got some chunks of clay in here. A little bit of 
iron stone, another lead shot. Well, anyways. Set this down. Nice piece of gold. Got another little piece over here. So it's still in here. Like I said. And that was in the clay. You can see what I was shoveling up. This is this is solid. I just broke some off and panned it out. I might have to put the clay claw back on my uh, hopper and run some of that. But you can see this is just all clay, very little material. You know, move some of these big boulders out of the way. Yeah, we'll probably still work a spot. I'll probably start moving all this out of here. I like the gold. All right, we're done playing around. We'll go up here and see if we can't get us a deer. It's about three o'clock. Our dam had washed out last year, so we started working on our dam again. Starting to pull up some water already. But it takes a lot of water for our pump, and I was still having to recirculate. So. Eh, we'll have to do some more work on it next time when we come out here. Let's go find us a deer. This is the last hoorah. sitting over there at the pond and there was already a doe standing out in the field when we got in there. They're coming out trying to find something to eat a little early. But everything's about half froze. Got a little bit of snow on the ground so they might move a little. Well, it's obvious they're moving a little early. But maybe I can catch something passing through here. I'm kind of sitting on a point. Hopefully we can get something today. This last trip out. All prospecting after this. Gotta get that gold. We'll be back. Alright. It's getting dark. We seen the one when we first come in. Dakota seen four more. Knowing that this is the last time out, he took a Hail Mary at one. We confirmed nest. One thing nice about snow. But like I said, this is the end of our season for uh, this year. We'll start uh, putting out some feeders and stuff probably in August. So until next time, we'll find some gold. Peace. Yeah.